I open my case in the dashboard. And the first thing I want to do is to insert section headers. I do that up here in the document uh, list options. I add a section header. And I'm now ready to import my documents. Uh, first, I import my case summary. And we're able to convert uh, a range of uh, formats to PDF. Here, it's a Word document. I just drag it to the first place here, and it will convert to PDF. Then we have the statements of case. And here we have a range of documents. I have Excel and Word and PDF, which will also be converted. You'll see we have a title column and a date column. Uh, in the date column, the dates listed here are metadata. So that means it's the date where the document was created, which is not of interest. So you can either modify this uh, manually because you can type directly in the interface of VisualDocs. You also have an option to automatically uh, detect uh, dates in documents and update the date column to the first detected date. And uh, in this case, the documents were filed with a title and a date. So what I'll go ahead and do now is to uh, copy the date in the title and move it to the uh, date column. I select my documents, deselect my uh, section headers, and then I go to document list options and choose batch edit. And here I can find some information in titles. And what I would like to, to find is this date format. Now VisualDocs have has uh, detected all the dates in the titles. And then I would like to copy the first match to the date column and remove the first match in the title col column. And here you go. We have updated the uh, date column. And I'm now ready to download the bundle. I go to my download center, choose document bundle. And here you have uh, various set settings. Um, you can change the, the uh, heading if you would like to do that. And we have different uh, templates. I choose the uh, claim bundle. Uh, hit OK. And now I just have to choose uh, different download settings. Table of contents, I choose to include a table of contents. I would like the English uh, date language, which looks like this. Page settings, I would like to add consecutive page numbers. I would like to hide these numbers until after the table of contents. And I would uh, like to choose a double-sided print. Uh, I can place my um, page number, bottom right, have different settings here, and then I can choose a font, and I'll go ahead and choose a Remo. And now I'm ready to download, and here's the trial bundle. You have uh, bookmarks here. We also insert uh, blank spaces, so all documents begin at a right page when you have double-sided print. Here's your a table of contents. You can choose to have your own logo embedded in, in the table of contents. And everything is hyperlinked here. So if we jump to, to this uh, budget here on page 25, here you go. Here's the budget. And this is how you create a trial bundle in VisualDocs.